July 1st and usually by this time it's so hot in the morning so we've been getting more rain um, got some more yesterday afternoon so I've just been out here weeding a little bit this morning it's been so nice it's so cool and so I thought I'd show you and the green beans are ready to be picked there's so many that I did not see but I want to talk about weeding and when I weed right after it's rained you don't want to weed right after a big big rain because it'll be real soggy but the perfect time like when it's just moist and it comes out easy but it's not taking a ton of soil but this is still taking some of the topsoil with it so I always want to try to lay something down to replace that um, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna use right now I don't have any hay I have some cut grass but I don't want to put freshly cut grass down I need something dry I'd love to throw some compost down, but I don't have any ready, so. Right here is a pile of pine straw, and then I put those weeds on top, hoping to just dry them out so that all the dirt and such topsoil can shake back down. Um, because this is one thing about this kind of gardening is the weeds don't ever quit unless you keep it covered. Like this right here is cardboarded down and nothing's growing but over here wherever there is nothing it's coming back and just yesterday this was full of weeds right here so anyway that's what i'm doing and i'll let you know what i end up using to mulch through here let's look at the beans i always forget that you really have to check often I've been checking too. I checked yesterday, but I missed. I missed these big ones under here. So I need to come back and pick some more, but I have some big, big bees doing work. So this isn't a honeybee, this is a big bee though. Real pretty. Real fuzzy like a bear. Got it. He keeps going upside down so I can't catch him. I guess I have about 20 green bean plants. Okay, so just a little update on these cucumber bugs, whatever, I forgot what they're called. So they can fly. So what I've done so far is last night I dusted with diatomaceous earth wherever they were. You can still see them. Okay, so I dusted them last night. Sorry, there's a bee flying around my head. Um, and then this morning I actually washed off the leaves and hand crushed a bunch of them because like if you see over here, there's diatomaceous on these leaves and the sun can't get to the leaf and photosynthesize with a bunch of crap on it. So, um, I washed it off after it sat all night and was supposed to be killing these. But right now, I'm also just hand killing them. And beware because they can fly. And they also do this thing where they just drop straight down so you gotta be quick, you gotta sneak up on them. So just get on a pair of gloves, don't be afraid, that one's already dead. And just be quick. That one just fell. Um, so that's what I'm doing right now, is a mix of dusting in the evenings with diatomaceous, and I think that kind of weakened them, or got rid of them, or some got rid of some of them. Um, but there's still quite a few this morning, so 
doing some hand, some looking here, and some hand crushing. And it's only gross if you're not wearing a glove, so I'm gonna keep looking out for them and I will keep you posted on how it's going with the cucumbers. Thanks for watching. Have a happy day.